This is a demonstration video for this Techniques SLD2 turntable. The turntable has been fully serviced and functions perfectly. As part of the servicing, I clean the speed selector switch, this pitch adjustment wheel. Also, I cleaned and adjusted the uh, variable speed resistors uh, underneath the platter. I've installed a brand new Audio Technica AT3600L cartridge and stylus and rebalanced the tone arm and set the anti skate force appropriately for the new cartridge. This is a semi automatic direct drive turntable. Uh, so, the semi automatic means once the stylus hits the end of the record, the tone arm will pick up and return to the rest position. So uh, let's get right to it with a planar record here. Okay, so I'll show you guys the uh, Pitch adjust in action. So right now I got it running a little fast. Dial it in. So as you can see, the strobes uh, showing a steady speed. So now we'll adjust the pitch faster. You'll start to see this kind of row of dots here start to drift this way around the platter. We'll go back the other way, so they'll slowly start to come back and start drifting left as we adjust the pitch down. The adjustment wheel is nice and smooth, there's no jumps in speed as you can see. Okay, now we'll take it back to the steady 33 RPM speed. Now you can see again the lines are staying steady, so we're dialed in at 33 RPMs. Okay, I'll uh, show you the stop function. So you hit the stop button, turn on will pick up, return to rest, and the turntable will turn itself off. Okay, I'll go to the end of the record to show the auto return. So hit the end of the record, pick up, and swing itself back over. Go to rest and turn off. Okay, I've got a 45 record here that I'll throw on to show the 45 RPM speed is functioning. Change the speed to 45 RPM. Ammonia. 
Okay, I'll go to the end to show the auto return on the 45. Works exactly the same as the 33. Okay, thank you guys for watching.